Oh, look how pink and fluffy. He's still a little dirty. He's dry? Thanks, Karen. No, he was in the wash. He looks much better. Your sheets are done, eh? Huh? My sheets are done. Your sheets are almost done. Oh, that's from Dylan's. This is dry. They're dry? No, he's They're still almost wet, dry. But... Okay, I'm gonna come. Oh. Yeah. What are you doing? Rubbing his back. M massage. Uh, feel good? It's uh, too Too much? Yeah. Uh, You like 31? Yeah. 1738. <laughs> hey. Oh, it's awesome. Looking for people. Where's our flag? Nobody's around. Uh -oh. Is everyone outside? Nobody's around. Oh my goodness. You want to sing some Fetty Wap? No. It's the only song he has. Am I here? Huh? It's a regular song. We were in the have not room. Oh, that's the air. It's good. Oh, uh, like four more. How come you know, have this right? song on? 17.30. Why know. do you have it? Because I live a swag life. I no, can't. you don't. <laughs> Your mom told you to have fun. I told you to have fun. <laughs> I know. I took I, it hard. I told you that. Well, I, no, I actually said that you're not funny, is what I said. No, you said uh, you're not fun. Fun, fun you're not is fun, what I yeah. said, yeah. This thing is sick. Oh, I can. Get the fuck out of here, boy. Bye. <laughs> Not rubbing and touching the nasty, dirty chicken feet. Uh oh, uh, 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 it's clean, by the <laughs> no, way. No, I'm not touching your feet. I need one of these. You're a peasant this week, so you need to massage. I cannot believe you just said that to me. Kevin just smiled. Kevin, you are loving this. It's I love when William torments you. No, you love that I'm a peasant downstairs in the have not room. Uh, no, I actually. <laughs> yeah, you do. I love when William torments you. You love it that I'm down. I love it that Karen's. I love Karen in there a little bit oh, more. Yeah. Oh my <laughs> That's God. That's funny. No, I, honestly. Karen is worse than slop. <laughs> like, I'm not Whoa. joking. Like, she's already in there saying a bunch of shit, and I'm just like, Karen, I, I have to leave this room. <laughs> like, just, she, she took the towels, the yeah. towels that we took the shower with, we and heard. she spread them on the fucking floor to sleep on. And then she's complaining about ho how horrible everything is. <laughs> Karen is worse than slop. That's what I, yeah, she, Karen is worse than Slop. Yeah, we put it there. In my opinion, she is worse <laughs> than Slop. Where's everybody? Jackie's outside. Jackie, Dylan is outside. Yeah. Please fix your microphone. Huh? It is. Oh God, oh God. Sure. It feels like stabbing. <laughs> There's not many people anymore. Huh? There's not many people anymore. I can't believe it. It's weird. It's weird, though. It's very weird. 
I prefer it like that, though. Oh. I don't know. It's weird. I've never lasted. I mean, when I left, yeah. there was more than half the house left. Yeah. So it was... Yeah. This is weird, I guess. There's like... Yeah, I want to actually have fun, and I don't feel like there's any really, really fun people left. Sorry, Kevin. That's fine. <laughs> oh, my God. I have fun in my weird ways. Iko Wong's fun and Kevin Martin's fun are Very different, different fun. Very different fun. <laughs> It's okay, my fun is a little different than her fun, too. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I hate it when the house gets so... Oh. Well, see, you can have fun with Karen. Dylan. Karen. Karen is funny, because she's Karen's like... Karen's fun. But having her in that have-not room is not oh, very fun for me. Not, she doesn't yeah. stop she's talking. Very fun this week, though. She just doesn't stop talking. Oh. Dylan is fun. Dylan's fun. Oh, but Karen does not stop talking. Poor Karen. She's going to have a rough go this week. Oh, yeah. Real yeah, she goal. is. Oh, when she was laying her, her robes down. Her, <laughs> she's she like, got towels. Oh, towels. She's like, there's a lump. And then, like, she, how she has it, like, she's supposed to move further down so I can stretch my legs. My legs are like this because yeah. she had pushed it all the way up and she won't push it down. Because she was like, well, I, I, I don't know what the fuck she said. It's gonna be fun. Dre's out. Might yeah. go outside. Yeah. You have a new hot tub in. Are you guys going hot tub it? In a bit, I am. Yeah. Oh. What time is it? Probably pretty late. It's still raining outside. I'm gonna go to bed. It's probably pretty late. I just want some fresh air. Fuck, they got that backyard cleaned up in a hurry. I got all this shit all over my fucking hand. I'm taking them off before I sleep in there, then that's what's gonna happen. We get some fresh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's still waiting for me. I'm not touching your feet. Well. Yeah, why am I. Yeah, this is Kevin's HOA. It's like, yeah, why is he. Enough. Oh, no, come on. No, this is enough. I've been doing it for a while. No, it's enough enough for you. Oh my gosh, you're spoiled. <laughs> she is spoiled. Oh, so. You are spoiled. You're very spoiled. You, you did my pimples. That was your... Yeah, I guess so. You're fine. Do you know why uh, Bruno would go to Dimitri and tell him that I was the reason why he almost went home week one? Right before eviction. Bruno went to Dimitri. And said, Ika is the reason. Ika wanted to flip the house to get you out week one. Right Bruno said that to Dimitri. Right before life evictions. Right before he left. Yeah. He said that to Dimitri. Yeah. I have no idea. And then, yeah. And then he said that. He went and told Dimitri that you were the reason he almost left in week one. Yeah. You he, voted for him to stay. I know, but he said I was the one who wanted to flip it in the first place to have oh. him leave. And then um, he told him that we, I told him to lie and to say that it was the plan all along to me in numbers, but. I did not know he said that to him. He said it right before live evictions. Before he took off. I didn't know he well, said that. Well, he came up here to campaign yeah. for a bit. Like w with one hour before, he's like, I'm gonna go try it one more time. He did. And, yeah. then, and after he told me that he would have my back in this game, he went downstairs and did that. Yeah. No, I don't know. I was on. Well, he just told me about it. He was like, what happened week one? Because Bruno just told me that it was you who... Yeah. I'm like, why would he do that? I did not know why he did that, and I was <laughs> unaware of it. What? Right before he left? Yes, like downstairs in the kitchen. I have no idea. Oh my god, I wonder if you knew about it. I did not know. About it. Are you lying, Kevin I was Martin? In the blue room. Are I, you lying, Kevin I Martin? Not lying. I was in the blue room <laughs> shedding a couple tears. Oh, you were sad? <laughs> yeah, I was sad. Yeah, yeah well, sad. he pretty much... He wasn't very nice in here. Yeah. To you. Yeah. Bruno. Yeah. yeah. Like after after he tried to he was turned out nice. Yes. And then when I was like, I'm like, I don't control people. I don't control people's vote or whatever. He's like, We'll see you in jury next week. Oh wow. Yeah. So he was a little bitter. Yeah. See I didn't get I didn't get any of that from and him. And then um he was also like I'm like, okay. I'm like, well. And then he went downstairs and did that. So that's why I 
I wasn't, I didn't feel as bad to see him leave because yeah. I was just like, I felt really bad. And then now. Now you don't. Now you're doing that. Yeah, I did not and know saying that. that. And then um, he was like, if. I, if he if I wanted him to stay here, he would stay. I'm like I don't control people. He did feel that. He said that a couple times that week. He's like. And I'm like I'm like well don't you think if Kevin wanted you to stay here you stay here too then? Yeah. And he's like no. Well I did want him to stay here. No I know but yeah. like I don't get why he's putting that on me. Yeah. When you're an ally in this house as well. Yeah. I mean I did talk to people and try to and ask people but it was just like no across the board. Did I not did I ask you about Bruno and you were not having any of it? Yeah. No. She was not having any of it. Yeah, Dre, you told me in the blue room, you're just like, I'm going to campaign for Bruno to leave. And I was yeah. like, I'm going to campaign for Bruno to stay. Yeah. Yeah, we were very honest about it. But he did feel like, he did feel like you, if he's like, if I can get, I, he said it a couple times, he's like, if Aika wants me to stay, I feel like I'll stay. He just had a lot of respect for your position in the house. But I feel like in this game, it's not about power or about control. It's about relationships. Mm -hmm. And people also have their own game to think about. I, Bruno and I were a pair, but at the same time, I'm not guilty for his actions. Okay. He did a lot of stuff that I was unaware of. Yeah. 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 Well, I did try talking to Dre about it. Mm -hmm. She did not want to have any parts of it. Yeah. And I don't blame her. She, you did say, for mine and Dimitri's game, it's the best thing to do. But... In your position, mm -hmm. you felt like you could move forward with Kevin more mm -hmm. than if Bruno was here. Mm -hmm. I know you you three and Dimitri, if Bruno and I stay on the block and there was no special power veto, you guys would have kept me. We would have kept you. I and know. that's mm -hmm. the only reason why he didn't use that veto is because yeah. we told him that we will keep you. Yeah. Like we swore. Mm -hmm. I was I knew that like you guys would have kept me for sure. We would have. Yeah. Them, you have to lie to people like that. Yes. But we have the numbers. Yeah. Like you know what I you know what I mean? Yes. But I, I was, don't know. I knew you guys wouldn't keep me, for sure. I was a little bit worried. I'm like, I was like, because the whole week, he was pretty much telling me, like, to work with you, to work with you, like, and yeah. all that. And then the last day, it, it was just weird. I was he just was like, telling me that the, the whole week, too. Yeah, he told me that. He's and like, then here, I'm like, well, he tried to come in and be like, you're, you're in a worse position than you think you are. I'm like, I never, ever thought I was in a great position, mm -hmm. ever, in this game. Like, not one time. So, thanks for the old news, but okay. Yeah. You know how I am. <laughs> and then he went and told Dimitri that. No, no, Dimitri was up here as well because Dimitri came in. Yeah. And then he was talking to the both of us. Mm -hmm. And then he said it. He's like, if you, he's like, let's keep it real. If you want me to stay here, I would be staying here. Mm -hmm. And I was honest and I did say, I feel like if Kevin is here without you, mm -hmm. this group has a better chance of working than if you were here. Yes. I'm not going to lie. I said that. So if he's going to be rude, mm -hmm. I'm going to be blunt. Yeah. Type of I was thing. unaware that that happened at all. I thought, I thought he I told that, you up here no. when, he, when you went upstairs to the bathroom. He knew, he's like, one hour before, he's like, I'm going to go talk to Ike and Dimitri one he more did. time. He came downstairs. I was already upset. He said, it's a no-go. Like, good luck, brother. He did yeah. not throw you guys under the bus to me or anything. I thought, I thought just, well, what? He threw me under the bus to Dimitri. Mm. And then when he went to the bathroom and I followed him, it was just a simple, like, goodbye, like, it's yeah. been fun playing with He you. did tell me here that I hope you don't... Uh, well, he did say... Well, when he was going on about, I know things, I know things. And I'm like, well, why don't you be honest mm -hmm. and say what you know? He's like, I can't say. And then I was like, well... He's like, I've been knowing things. I'm like, so if you've been knowing things and you wanted us to work together, this is the reason why I couldn't trust you in the first place because you knew things mm -hmm. and you didn't tell me. And then he was like... Well, I've realized things now, mm -hmm. type of thing. And I'm like, well, I gave Kevin my word and I'll keep it if I win. So if he doesn't want to keep it, I don't care. He goes, no, 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 no. I'm not saying that's not what he's going to do. Mm -hmm. That's not, I'm not. Like, so he, he did say that it would be in our, both our best interest. But then when he did that, I'm like, well, if he said that to him, mm -hmm. who knows what he said he to didn't, you? He didn't say it to me. I don't know. It just rubbed me the wrong way that he would do that. Yeah. Type of thing. Like, yeah. I had already told him pretty much how week one went down anyway. Yeah. So he, he was probably, I think he, after that conversation, he probably felt responsible for leaving partly due to you, obviously. I, I definitely if he think, thinks, I, def, I definitely think he feels like if I wanted him to stay, yes. I believe he believes in his heart that he would have stayed. I, he, he mentioned that me and a I'm not, times too. If I could trust Bruno, um, I probably would have pushed harder than I did. Yeah. But 
I didn't, I, I, and I did tell him this actually. I was like, the kind of person that you are, mm -hmm. what you're saying right now, you mean it. You mean it right now. Yeah. You mean it. For like, sure. I 100% believe that you mean it. But this game in this house, it doesn't change on my season, it changed week to week. This house changes day to day. Yes. And I don't know if tomorrow you mean it. Yeah. So I'm a little bit hesitant. I'm sorry. So it, it got a little bit heated. I didn't know that it got heated before with you guys. Yeah. Here. It got a little, like, just because I'm, and, and then he, he was like, well, he got, because he got a little aggressive and mm -hmm. he was like, well, I'll be seeing you in jury. I'll be seeing you in jury. We could talk about it in jury. Yeah. I'm like, okay. I'm like, no problem. When he came downstairs, he said like, it's a no go. Because he told me he was going to come campaign to you guys one last he time. He did. Like, he pulled me in first, mm -hmm. and then Dimitri kind of walked in and asked if he wanted some privacy, and then he asked him to sit down yeah. type of thing. And he kept on, again, like, going with the whole position, position, yeah. position thing. Yeah, that's all he talked about. Right? <laughs> that, yeah. Real. Right? So at that point, I'm, again, I'm like, and now you see why I can't blame for not... Trusting you, yeah, because you need that vote, and you're still you're still trying to taint me against the person that vote you need. Yeah, exactly. So it did get a little bit. I didn't know it got heated at all. Yeah, it really did. Yeah, and so he said, "I'll see you in jury, Aika." Yeah, no, really? to me and Dimitri, he goes, "I'll see, I'll be seeing you or you in jury." Yeah, and I'm like, well, I could have been H O H, Bruno." So yeah, I'm like, I could win something too. So I didn't know it got heated at all. Yeah, and I thought you were aware of it. No. He literally went downstairs and said, it's a no-go. Good luck, brother. Well, He didn't throw you guys under the bus to me before you I, I'm, I'm really surprised because I, I could not believe he said that. No. I was just like, because he asked me about it. I was just like, he's like, yeah, he's like, Bruno told me. And then he even told him the lie that we tried to come up with to smooth things over. So I know Back he's not lying one. about it. Yeah. And I'm like, well, he's not lying about that. I'm like, I was trying to get you guys to work together. So like. Yeah, exactly. But I can't believe he actually did that. I, I didn't know any of that. That's a little surprising, too. I think, because he didn't campaign very hard the whole week. I believe he thought, I, he campaigned a lot to me. To you. And, um. Because he didn't talk to you. No. No. no Did no. Bruno talk to you, Dre? Mm -hmm. Did Bruno talk to you? Never. Not really. Not he campaigned all. to you, too. I think, Bru I think Cindy campaigned to William and Dre, mm -hmm. and Bruno probably saw that, like, Dre was probably like, no. So I think he thought the way through to Dre was through me. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I think he, I think he generally thinks he went home because of me. I, I, he thought the vote was because of you, basically, yeah. 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 I just don't get why people think I have that much power in this freaking like house. Like, a couple times he's just like, I have to talk to Aika, I have to talk to Aika, I have to talk to Aika. That was in his mind, for sure. Yeah, because he, he has, like, he has. And, like, there are times when he would say stuff, and I would be like... This is great. Like this, like I really like this could work. This yeah. could work. This could work. And then I sit back and I think about it. And I did tell him, I'm like, I feel like I don't know if I could trust you. But I am building trust with Kevin. I do not trust mm -hmm. Kevin a hundred percent. I'm gonna trust Kevin 80%. Mm -hmm. But I'm building trust. And I do feel like without you here, I could trust him more. Yeah. And with you staying here, I don't know if I could trust the both of you in this house together yes. moving forward as a group because it never worked before yeah i did tell him that and he was like why would i if you gave me life in this house one more day in this house why would i turn back on you why would i do that to you yeah. why did I do it? and i'm like bruno i'm like i've gone with my gut and when he told me he sealed me in jury i'm like i've gone with my gut every single time in this house and if i leave this house because of my gut i'll leave happy mm -hmm. i will the when i played in season two i did not go with my gut like, things felt off all around the place, and I didn't listen to it. Yeah. And if I went home tomorrow, I'd feel very happy with how I played this game and listening to myself. Yes. Even if it stared me wrong. And he goes, okay, we'll discuss that in jury. Okay. So that was his, like, last shot. <laughs> yeah. He was pissed off that was his Oh, yeah. Last. He was like, okay, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll discuss this in jury, is what yeah. he said to me. I was yeah, like, okay. A little, a little bit snarky. I was like, okay. Like, I'm like, I told him. Oh, and I also told him, I'm like... So what you're telling me is if you have a, if, if I'm a girl and I'm dating this guy and he lies to me mm -hmm. and cheats on me and I forgive him and he does it again and I forgive him, what does history tell you that? It will repeat itself, right? Yeah. And 
when it does repeat itself, who's going to feel sorry for me? He's like, I see what you're saying, but it's different. Yeah. It's different. So this was all in his last campaign, too. Yeah. So here. he was campaigning, and he was yeah. doing the thing. And I guess when I just feel like I have, how I've, I'm not a very good liar. I'm really not, which no. is why I have to resort to telling the truth. Yes. And I was like, I, 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 I don't feel, I feel like you staying here is not good. Yeah. After, no. like, looking at everything... I I'd, like, I went back and forth with it all week. Like me and Dimitri sat here and we talked about it. I would say for a good like hours, mm -hmm. and we worked out every single scenario. And we just did not think it was good for our game. And I did not think it was good for your game either. Mm -hmm. To be quite honest with you, I thought Bruno Stain would have been way better for my game. No, because you don't think so. No, because right now you have me, Dimitri, in this house, oh. and you're seen as you're alone. Yeah. And if someone's gonna come after someone, it'll be a pair uh -huh. opposed to somebody who's alone. First. But Bruno is like my ride or die. He's someone I could always trust. Like I, I can't see that not having him would, like I wanted him to. We bang our heads in together. In terms the whole week. of like, threat level in the house, mm -hmm. would not be great for your game. In terms of trusting someone, then yeah. Yes. Yeah, that I'll say yes. Because there's no way if that one person won HOH, you're going on the block. Yes, and if he doesn't win big. HOH, and 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 if you and if you're on the block, he will fight for POV and he'll protect you. Mm -hmm. A hundred percent, yes. Yeah, it's big. But in terms of position, as laughing, he likes yeah. to put it yeah. in the house, it puts you in a better position if he's not here yes. because you're not as threatening. Without my ride or die. Yes. Yes, that makes sense. The threatening people become me and Dimitri. Yeah. Right? So even if people are like, oh, okay, they're, they're going to come after us first. It's just natural. Yeah. No, I agree with what you're saying. Yeah. No, I didn't know. I didn't know Bruno. And oh my God! I was so mad. Yeah, you were pissed. I was pissed. I honestly felt so bad. Yeah. Even like my message, I felt really, really bad. And after that, I was He's like, like no. "This is why my gut was right." Mm -hmm. This because you quickly turn like that, because like it's just how quickly he turned, and then went downstairs and did that. Really pissed me off. Yeah. No, I promise you, he, we've talked the whole week. We were always banging our heads together. Bruno, how can we get Mickey stay? How can we, let's talk to these people. Let's talk to these people. Yeah. Like I tried. I, I would have done anything for him to stay. But that hour before, he did not throw you under the bus. He simply said, good luck. Like, don't be yeah. sad. Like, I thought fight. he did because he did it with Dimitri. No, he didn't. And I'm like, why is it like a trend that when people leave this house, they throw me under the bus? No. <laughs> like, every fucking time someone leaves this house. The farewell. They're not even on the block with me. Yeah. And they have to be like... Aika, Aika, Aika. Like, what the hell? <laughs> I guess N Netta did Did Cindy? Cindy did it. Cindy threw a couple people under the bus. Oh, though. Cindy threw... Cindy did a lot of Cindy work. Cindy threw me under the bus. But she threw me under the bus, I would say, days leading. Mm -hmm. The day of, then she threw you guys under the bus. I know to she me. did, yeah. Which yeah. is why I had a hard time trusting you guys, because that's somebody... Yeah. That I was close with, that you're close with, that's telling me these things. Not just people around the fucking house. Like, you know what I mean? Exactly. So Netta threw some dirt. Cindy threw some dirt. Bruno. Bruno, I didn't think he was going to. but I, I cannot believe he did that. I am actually shocked mm -hmm. that he did that. Like, I don't know. I'm honestly shocked. Shocked. Because he was pretty chill the whole week on the block. He really was. I don't know why he thought... I'm not uh, an emotional player. No. I think about logic all the time. Yeah. And I looked at every single scenario, and I looked at it from every single angle. Mm -hmm. And it, it, there's no point in leaving somebody in this house that were, I could go to bed at night and sleep, and I cannot trust that person. Mm -hmm. Like, two of you together would not have my trust. Yeah. I, I would feel like... And I told you, that's after Dimitri nominated us, I was like, I totally understand. Like, I was pissed, I was mad, that was my emotion. Yeah. But from a logical perspective, of course. Like, it makes... And e even even um, after that, mm -hmm. you, could, you could ask her. Me, her, and Dimitri had a big blow up in this room. Yeah. After that nomination. Because of the two Vez. Yeah. It, yeah. it wasn't like, even though I did think you guys were like snakes and all this stuff. Yes. It kind of felt like, and then I heard the stuff that Karen was saying. It kind of felt like, is it really a vet thing that, you know, the, you guys want all the vets out? Mm -hmm. 
so you could say you played all the vets. Wait, so she she thought that we wanted all the vets out so we could say. No, Karen was going around saying that she wants all the vets out. That pretty much all the newbies want all the vets gotcha, out. Okay. So so it could be like we outplayed these people gotcha. who were like giants type of thing. Yes. So then we had like a blow up about it and I slept over there mm -hmm. type of thing. I know he has my back, but I think it was just like there are no more of us left type gotcha. of thing. It was a little bit weird seeing it type of thing, but I could not believe he fucking did that. I was so mad. I did. I, this is the literally... I, first I've heard about it because he came down and he, and he was just pretty chill and he's like you know good luck like we hugged it out we kind of laughed about some moments of the season like I was like okay he's like are you trying to see who could last the longest injury because if I leave this house then but he didn't get like that until after he saw that it really wasn't going anywhere gotcha then it's just his frustration I think he was frustrated, yeah. Because yeah. I genuinely believe that he was like, if, I, if you want me to stay here, I'll stay here. That's he what did he kept, think he kept that. on saying that. Yeah, he did think that. Back there. He did give you a lot of credit. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, I feel well, like. Well, I knew you guys were going to, that's, when you guys told me that you guys were going to keep me over Bruno, that's why I shut, I shut down my campaign to William. I didn't ask you again with the veto. Mm -hmm. I knew you guys were going to keep me. I knew it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I, I don't know. It's just... He, yeah, I think... I think returning players or vets or people who watch this show, mm -hmm. they think that being in this house is about manipulation and it's about control it's and power. Right. And it's really not. No. That's... If you think that way, that is what will like like that is what will get you in a messed up situation. Yes. If you that arrogance, thinking that you could control people, manipulate people, yeah. and use power over people, we do. We're people. We don't have powers. Yeah, exactly. Like you really don't. Yeah. You know, it's about relationships, and it's a two way relationship. That's what my mom said. She's like. You, there's people in there that are going to make their own decisions. Yes. And you can't control that. You cannot control it. So she's like, be accepted. Like It of, is. Yeah. And it's a two-way street. Like, I cannot screw somebody that has never done anything to me in this game since week one, even mm -hmm. when they had no reason to, to trust me, trusted me, mm -hmm. to keep somebody that I know will fuck that person. Yeah. It's a two-way street. No, nah, he was just, I don't, I don't know. He's just frustrated. Yeah. Just frustrated, I guess, but... I, I just hate that. Like, I wish Demetria told me that before he left. Because I would have... I, I want to get off my chest. You would have given him back I think I'm picking it out on you right now. Yeah. Because, oh. <laughs> because, like, I didn't get a chance to get it off my chest. Yeah. And w whatever happened... So he blamed you for trying to flip the house vote. He told Dimitri that... I was the one who was responsible for flipping the yeah. house to get him out. Like, like he told him that I wanted to do that. Gotcha. I wanted but that to was, do that. But that was on day six. Yes. We've, we've, pl we've known each other for 42 more days after Yes. That. I think, I think like, and I, I, I did tell him what happened. I was like, I sat on the couch. Yeah. Bruno was sitting right there. And he was like, this is a mistake. This is a mistake. Yes. Like, this is a mistake. And I was like, I am not working with Dimitri. So I'm, I was like... Are you, like, what, like, what are you saying? And he was like, this is a mistake, man. This is a mistake. And I was like, I'm like, do you want to flip it? Because it's not too late. Yeah. And at some point, you came down. I was right there. And you sat there. Yeah. And then he was saying it's too late. And you said it's not too late. It's not too late, yeah. And then I was like, okay, fine, whatever then. That's pretty much how that conversation went down. Yeah. And that's exactly what I told him. And then he actually told me, and I, I think it was a lie now, looking back, that Mark told him mm -hmm. that Cassandra threw me and Gary under the bus. That's why I confronted Mark mm -hmm. in that blue room. Do you remember that story? Do you remember? To be it? honest, I don't. Why do, you <laughs> think people, why do you think people were yelling at Mark? But Gary and Cassandra, Gary was mad at Cassandra. Because Bruno said Cassandra threw me and Gary under the bus. Yes. That Mark just told him that. Yes. So when I went upstairs. Because Mark had this lie, apparently. But Bruno was the one who said it. Okay. So when I asked Mark, I'm like, Mark, I'm like, did Cassandra 
throw me and Gary under the bus and told you that it was us who was leading the charge and da, da, da. Yeah. And he said yes. But I asked him because Bruno told me that. Gotcha. And then that's when Gary flipped out. And then that's when that whole fight happened. And then it went, sh it went wild. And then it went wild. Yeah, it was nuts. Right? And then that's how that happened. But obviously you didn't lead the charge. You voted to keep Dimitri. You were part of the seven. But, but I would have been... But I, I think I think what he was trying to say was that I was with it, yeah. which I was. You were for because, sure because, and I did tell him that. But why that, that wouldn't? Even, if Bruno wanted to throw you under the bus to Dimitri, that wouldn't even have any credibility. It was forty-two days ago. Like we yeah. didn't know each he other. He did it. Obviously, your relationship with Dimitri has developed yeah. since then, right? Yeah. That's like he saying, did. that's like saying in week five I said something about Will or or, or no I mean like day five like day five yeah, yeah. it's like okay it we've no gotten to know each other now. for forty one days forty yeah it, that look, really Ka Karen me Dylan thought Karen was nuts in week one I know and look at their like like yeah, people change right. and relationships yeah. develop I just you know? can't believe he fucking said that mm -hmm. like oh and also told the lie that we came up with do you remember that lie that we came up with because I voted against Dimitri. So we wanted to say that it was planned or something. Yes, yes. But I didn't even... I went to Dimitri and I was like, dude, like, I voted against you. I no, I know. So you didn't have to... It was... He was so upset about it. But it was just weird because I feel like... I felt like you guys kind of knew that people, like, mm -hmm. with them, like, me, Cindy, Netta, were not voting with you guys. Did you guys know that? Honestly, when that vote went down, I felt like I was on the wrong side. I didn't even think it would be 7-6. <laughs> Okay, so wait a minute. When we were upstairs, yes, and Netta was downstairs right here. Bruno asked her, "What are you doing?" And she was, "I'm voting with Ika." Yes, Netta wanted to vote with you because she, if Netta, Netta said that if she ever went against you, that it would be your relationship would be done. Like, yeah, I would say week one. Yeah, I trusted her so so much. Yes, and I and I know that like I would have had her back no matter what. And yeah. I, I'm, I was like, just just this one time, just just vote with me. It's just one time. Mm -hmm. After this, I don't give I don't give a damn. Just this one time. Yeah. Right. And Cindy, I'm like, Cindy, Cindy said yes. I knew for sure you were not going to, but... Oh, yeah, because I put up my hand and I was yeah, like... Yeah, I knew for guys. sure. There's so much going on. I'm like, I am, like, between Mark and Dimitri, I wanted to Mark to say more. So I'm like, yeah. I'm voting for Mark. But once we sat down on the couches, I felt like I, I was on the wrong side for sure. You after did. After that blow up Like, happened. you had to have known that you weren't sure if you had Netta's vote, Cindy's vote, or my vote at that time. Wasn't sure. So for I him, knew probably you were... Voting with Dimitri. Yes. So for him to be like, he was. Bl he told him that he was blindsided. That Bruno was blindsided. Bruno said he was blindsided with that vote, gotcha. and that he would have voted to keep him had he had known. Oh. And he and he's like he's and he, and he was like, I'm like Bruno. I'm like, do you not remember how the conversation was? Mm -hmm. How that conversation went in the first place? Yeah. Like I think you're forgetting what happened because I don't forget. Yeah. You know. Yeah, it was a crazy day. It was a crazy day. Again, I'm, I'm, Bruno was like my ride or die, my best friend. Like, I would never go against him. And I'm, but at the same time, we were different players, and I don't feel like I'm responsible for... No, I don't. No, I don't. But I thought, I just thought you would have known about it. That blow up an hour before? No. Yeah. I knew, because we talked in the pantry, and we're just like, dude, it's not... It's like, go talk to Eichel one more time. Yeah. I was like, go talk to Eichel one more time. So he came up here. He came downstairs and he was just like, nope, I'm going home. And I'm like, good game, dude. Like, but he didn't throw you under the bus. I did tell him. I'm like, listen, I'm like, I'm like I respect that you have to try. Mm -hmm. You have, you to, have try. to try. Like, like I, I wouldn't want to leave this house either not trying. Yeah. But that's not the way you try. <laughs> yeah. He was just a little bitter, I guess. Yeah, I think, uh, no, for sure. I would have been. So if you would have known that he told Dimitri and he was still in the house, you would have, like, oh, yeah. given it back to him. Up. Yeah. I would have. Sorry, Kevin. I know he's your number I, one. It's fine. Ride or die. But, like, I would have been, like, I, I would have said something for yeah. sure. Yeah. Regardless if... And I wouldn't have expected you not to, you know? <laughs> That's who you are. <laughs> Exposed party. It's not about exposed. It's about, like, it's about, like, have some integrity. Like, I, I am... I, if I have to leave this house, mm -hmm. I promise you, mm -hmm. I will go in peace. Yeah. After I yell all the people I hate, yeah. like forget being like, forget being like me running over here and being like, on day one, two, three, four, five, and six, this, I, would, I don't do shit like that. Yeah. I, I stay in the moment and I'll ream people out and I'll get the fuck out. Yeah. Because if, when I leave here, I want to leave people I'm working with in a good position. Yes, me I want to make. I want to make sure that if I leave here, he's okay and she's okay. Mm -hmm. 
Even if, and I did tell him, I'm like, if I go home and you think working with people who are against me is best for your game, work for, work with those exactly. people. Yeah. I, t I told him that. Yeah. I, I, will, I, will, I will fuck off and leave and get, and get the hell out. And, get and I know Bruno here. wanted to leave me in a good position. Like, I know. Oh, he yeah, did. he did. Yeah, he really cared he about He did. That. Like, he really, like, he, like, even if, but at that point, the things that he was saying, I wasn't sure if he was, after when he was like, see you in jury and blah, 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 then he started pushing for you. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of like, well, at this point, I don't want to hear what you exactly. have to really you're say when you're already talking about see you in jury and being yeah. rude. Like, you know, like. Yeah. Um, or whatever. Frustration I, probably just got to him, but. Yeah, no, for sure. I told him, I'm like, listen, Bruno, I'm like, if you think that if I leave next week, I'll regret sending you home, I won't. Mm -hmm. Because that's what my gut told me to do, and that's, that's where I going. voted, and that is how I will play this game and leave this house. Because there's nothing worse than not following your gut. Yeah. And it screws you over later. No, I agree. That, I lost sleep for three years because of that. After season two. Yeah. So what did your gut tell you in season two that you went against? It told me to put up Andrew and Kenny. During your HOH? Yeah. And you put up... Heather and Paul. Heather and Paul. I put up Heather and Paul because I know the whole house hated them at the time. Yeah. And I felt like it was very, very early. Uh-huh. And nobody else had made any big moves. And the moment I did it, I'd be a huge, huge target. Mm -hmm. And they would come after me. So you regretted that for a long time? For three years. For three years. I regretted it. Because you won the, like... Uh, the before and after, right? I won a memory challenge. I won the POV, that physical challenge. And I also won the ball challenge. Like, all yeah. of them back to back. Nice. I did. And I, I just suck at challenges this season. I don't know. It's weighing on my self-confidence a lot. I know, I hear you. I honestly yeah. have, like, cried about it. Like, why do oh, I really? suck so bad? Mm -hmm. I used to be really good in season two. Like, I would never, I'd walk into a comp and say, I'm going to win it. Yeah. Every time. And now I walk into a comp, I'm just like... Oh, God. Yeah, like that. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I do. I, it's, I don't know. I was a lot better in season two at comms. A lot more confidence that way. But not this season. I'm not the comp queen I one used to be. <laughs> Yeah, I can confirm that Bruno thought that if you wanted him to stay, Oh, yeah, he said stay. it in here. But I he never also, said it before that. What's that? He never said it to me before that. He said until it to me today. a couple days before. Yeah, he told me that. During campaign. Today. Yeah, he told me a couple days before. But after that blow up an hour before, he did not come back and spit it to oh, me. Oh, no. I thought, he, I thought for sure he would. He I was just not. like... I was so shocked. I'm like, day six, really? Like, you're really bringing yeah, up... Yeah, that's so irrelevant. Like That's what I'm trying yeah. to say. Mm. <laughs> Fucking six. And we didn't know each other on day six, right? I don't know when I changed my mind about that, like, I can't vote this guy out. The Mark Dimitri vote? I was sitting right there. Yeah. And uh, I knew he trusted me, but I was going against my gut for people that I thought I could trust at the time. Yes. And uh, he came up the stairs and he sat right on the, I was sitting and I think I was facing Cindy at the time. Mm -hmm. And he came up and he sat and he looked right at me and he's like, it flipped again. And then he was like, should I just go? But the, the look in his eyes, I knew I was screwing this guy over. Yeah. And he trusted me, like he trusted yeah. me. And I was just like, and I felt that way with Mark, and you felt that way with Dimitri. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We, we were pretty much on two opposite sides of what we wanted to do. Yeah. And Bruno wanted to keep Mark, so I don't know why he's acting like he wanted to keep Dimitri. He wanted to keep Mark. He wanted to keep Mark. Yes, he did. Yeah, he wanted to keep Mark. I don't know why he's doing that. Yeah, he wanted now, to keep Mark. Like, he did. I know he did, because oh, when I sat there... For sure he did. He said it. Yeah. Oh, we talked about it for days. We, we both wanted to keep Mark. Like, <laughs> so I don't get why he would, and even to me afterwards, he's been like, that guy was casted for me. He's the Bobby of the season. Mm -hmm. He trusted me. He probably would have trusted me a lot more than he trusted you. 
And I'm like, Rune, I'm like, I, 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 does it really matter if he trusts me more than he trusts you if we're all okay? Yeah, exactly. And he, and he was like, that, um, he goes, you know, I did, he goes, I flipped on him for you guys. I was like, whoa, do you not remember what happened on that couch? Like, let me just refresh mm -hmm. your memory. And I told him what happened, and yeah. he was like, oh, see, I don't remember it like that. Yeah. That's weird that it would bring up day six, though. Like, it just seems like a weird day. It's a long time ago. It's a long, long time ago. Whatever. I wish Dimitri told me that before he left this house. Then we would have seen some fireworks. I mean, I would have talked to him calmly. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> For five seconds. Oh. For five seconds. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh my I know it's <laughs> I would have. I would have wanted to know. I, I want to know. Yeah. I'm asking you for answers. Bruno wanted to keep not. Mark. Yeah. Can you please tell Dimitri? That? I can tell Dimitri that. I don't know can why. Can you please tell him that? I don't know. Why. Because it's like it's very frustrating that he did that. Yeah. Because after that vote, there was a scheme to like Dimitri on HOH or whatever, and then and it was there was a scheme or whatever. I'm just like fuck this. I went to Dimitri. I pulled him in. I was like. Oh no. He knew that you were going, that you were voting him out because you told him that. Yeah. Downstairs. Yeah, exactly. Like he told me, he's like, he's like Kevin actually, he's like Kevin was the only one who told me like, yeah, I'm voting you out. Yeah. And I told him, I told him before, and like, yeah, I was he, flipped he and like, like I want Mark to say, and then after. And it's funny because you were in there rallying people that I'm back. Sure, I was. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, let's go. Like, and it did not work. How no, it did didn't. it fall on me, though? Oh, like, I was rallying people so how, hard. But how was it me? I was, my adrenaline was going. I was like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, BB can five. Bail. But can, I, but no. can I ask you, but why is that put on me? I, I don't know why Bruno put it on you. I do not know why. He tried me before he left. He came from my edges before he left. Because then after the vote, Demetri wins and I just went, talked to him. I was like, dude, you have a lot of reasons to put me up. Like, I voted. I wanted you gone. And, and he we didn't. Had honest conversation. And he didn't put me up. Like, we had a very honest conversation. There's a whole scheme to kind of, like, hide it or whatever. It's like, Yeah, no, no I told him the truth. Yeah. I told him the truth. I told him that Bruno was just scared. Because Bruno went to him and was like, I'm so sorry, man. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Bruno never told us that he said that he was so sorry to him. So we're like, listen, like, maybe saying that you knew all along blah, blah, would help. But if I had known that he was like... I'm sorry, did it? Then obviously that whole thing. Like, but I told him after. I'm like, listen. I'm like, he was just scared, mm -hmm. and he said that. I'm like, but you know, whatever. Mm -hmm. I did not know that Bruno came for your edges before he left. Yes, he did. And there's still. <laughs> like I can that. see you're, you're fired he, up about oh, it right I'm now. I'm so mad. Yeah. I am so bad. So Bruno leaves, and I'm so upset now because, like, bye-bye. Like, be gone. Want to know why? Because I was, like, we have gone back and forth on this. Mm -hmm. And, like, and I've even, like, against my better judgment, against my better gut, have been, like, Dre, is there any way, like, like do you see anything? Have I not had conversations with you about this? Mm -hmm. I've talked to Dimitri about, like, we've gone over every single scenario. Yeah. And the best scenario was we felt like we would be stronger trusting you more yes. if he was not here. Yes. Like, I'd rather have one person in this house who lied to me than two. Yeah. <laughs> Cause, and you're probably right, because if Bruno was in this house, I was going to listen to Kevin and Bruno, and that's it. Yes, you would have. Yeah. You would have. Yeah. And I've always looked after you, but I always listened to Bruno ahead of yeah. you. Yeah. All the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because Bruno was my person. And that's just the true team. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's the true team. Uh-huh. <laughs> He's like, uh-huh. That's the true team. <laughs> I know. But I know. It is. Yeah. Like, and that's, I think that's the thing. It was like, yeah, I, it, it would it would have been harder, like, for me to be like, yeah, da da da, da. Like, I wanted to believe in it, and, and I saw all the points. But if I cannot trust the mm -hmm. people, I'm like, uh, there's no point. Yeah. There's just no point. Oh, he irked me before he left. He irked me. So your goodbye message was nice? Yes. And then you're like, can I change it? Can yes. <laughs> oh, you asked it? Yeah. No. Oh. Let's not talk about that because they'll come from my edges too. <laughs> oh, I was so bad. Like... <laughs> Oh. oh, so mad. 
<laughs> I was mad because she's like that on the button. Oh, I was yeah, mad. <laughs> because he, to the point where I can't contain it, Dimitri just told me this information. I'm going to go ask Kevin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what I know is that he wanted to keep Mark. He For did. Sure. He did, of course. Because on that couch, that's what he tried to be like. Mm -hmm. he, also, he also said he had an awesome relationship with Dimitri on week one. Like, he said he had a good relationship, but yes, I, he, he did, always but he wanted, wanted to keep Mark. Yes, he did. Because yeah. I sat there, and I was like, everything was good. And, he's, yeah. and I looked at him, and he's like, I don't know, man. I'm like, what? And he's like, I told him, he's like, this is a mistake. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I, I know this is blah, blah, blah. And... I thought I was being selfish, and I don't want to be that person. Mm -hmm. So I was like, did you want to flip this? And he's like, it's too late. Yeah. It's too late. Netta came and sat, and she was like, no, 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 no. Like, guys, let's not do this. Let's not do this. Do you remember? She was like, no, 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 she no, no, no. She was very scared, yeah. She was scared. And then I was like, this could happen if you want to. And he was like, no, it's too late. It's too late. And you're like, It's not, not late. too late. <laughs> oh, I was so far up. He was said, like, not Kevin did this. <laughs> it's not too late. And I was like, okay. Well, and then he told me, like, when you jumped up and ran, <laughs> I still sat there with him. And then well, that's when he told me the whole Cassandra <laughs> thing that Mark said. Gotcha. So, I mean, Mar Mark backtracked a lot. Yeah. And had he not backtracked, Gary, Mark, Mark was going to Mark was gonna stay until we had that meeting up here. And Dallas was like, who's voting for Mark? And, and like four people put their hands up. No, 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 because at that point, at that point, Dimitri had came and sat. Is that when he came and sat? He sat beside me. Oh, yeah, looks at you. And I'm telling you, like, at that point, like, after that, it literally messed me up. Because I'm like, somebody looked at me that needs to rush you. And I felt like, and I had to kind of sit and think about the time he met with me. That's after that. Uh, for that week, yeah. I was off. Yeah. Off. Like, you know, you think you're off, you're and you're oh, different. Very. I regarded this as you're in reg. Oh, that was week two when you were have not. I was off. Yeah. And yeah. then I remember, but I was, that shook me up because I was like, well, how do I want to play this game? Yeah. What am I willing to do? How am I willing to, like, what am I doing? And I, after that is when I was like,